In today's video, we see very famous game. I think you watched this game, but it will refresh your memories. So this game was played in 1928 in Melbourne, Australia. So without wasting time, let's move. In this game, Gunnar Gundersen play with white pieces and AH Fall play with black pieces. White starts with e4 and black replies with e6. d4, d5, French defense. And here white plays e5, so game converts into French defense advance variation. And black continues with c5, c3, c takes d4, c takes d4. Bishop b4 check, knight c3, knight c6, knight f3, knight e7, and black want to castle king side. And white continues with bishop d3, and black castles king side. Here pause the video and think the next move of white. If you find congrats, let's see. And here white continues with bishop takes h7 check and white sacrifice his bishop and black accept the sacrifice. King takes bishop and white continues with knight g5 check. And here you can see that black's king has 4 options. If black move his king on h8 then checkmate comes immediately. You can see that on the board. So black can't move his king on h8 and if black move his king on h6 then you can see that knight takes f7 and double check. Check comes from knight and bishop and discord attack and fork on queen so black will lose his queen. So black's position become poor and black will lose and if black move his king on g8 then queen h5 comes. And the next threat is queen h7 checkmate. If black moves g6 then checkmate comes immediately. And if black moves f6 then checkmate comes immediately. Because f7 square is covered with knight. So queen h7 is checkmate. And if black continue with rook e8 then queen h7 check. And the king has only one move. King f8, queen h8 check and a knight g8 is forced move. And after knight g8, knight h7 check and king has only one move. King e7 and after bishop g5 check, you can see that black can't move his king on d7 because black will lose his queen. And if black moves f6, then queen takes g7 is checkmate because this d6 square is covered with pawn. And if black move his knight on f6 and create pressure on queen, then queen takes g7 comes and you can see that black's position is not better and black can't save his knight. If black move his king on d7 then knight takes knight check comes and you can see that black will lose his rook with fork. But after knight g5 check black continues with king g6 and white continues with h4 and here black's position is very critical. So black sacrifice his knight, knight takes d4 but it is too late. So white didn't accept the sacrifice and white move his queen on g4. And you can see that next threat. Next threat is knight takes e6 and discover check comes from queen. And the discover attack create on black's queen. So black will lose his queen. And here you can see that black's king has only one move. And if black move his king on h6, then knight takes e6 check comes and you can see that checkmate comes. If black move his king on h7, then queen takes g7 is checkmate. And if black continues with g5, then queen takes g5 check and you can see that checkmate comes immediately. But in this position, black can't move his king. And black continues with f5 and create pressure on white's queen and prevent this knight takes e6 check, discover check from queen. So black can capture this white's queen after knight takes e6. 
but on the bold you can see that black's position is very weak so white continue with h5 check and the king has only one option king h6 and here white continues with knight takes e6 discover check from bishop and you can see that discover attack on queen so black is in danger if black move his king on h7 then checkmate comes immediately and if black moves g5 then queen takes g5 check and you can see that checkmate comes and if black moves f4 to cut the bishop's line then checkmate comes because this pawn is supported by rook but after knight takes e6 check black continues with g5 and you can see that if you know this n percent method white can take this pawn with n percent this is called n percent so white accept this g5 pawn with n percent and checkmate because king has no moves these two squares are covered with knight and rook covers h file and this g pawn is supported by queen so black can't capture this g pawn what a checkmate if you like the game then please subscribe the channel for watch more these type of videos and for your support